This video will demonstrate how to use the ArcGIS Explorer app, which provides access to maps in Uplan from your mobile device. First, you'll need to install the app from either the Google Play Store or the iTunes App Store. I happen to be using an Android device. It may look different for you, depending on your version of Android, or if you're using an iOS device, like an iPhone or iPad. Once it's installed, launch the app. Notice that if you don't have a Uplan account, you can still access UDOT maps that are publicly available. Use, to do that, use the Continue Without Signing In option. Without signing in, you have access to public maps hosted in ArcGIS Online, which includes the public Uplan maps. Use the search functionality to find the map that you're interested in viewing. Remember that you are searching a wide variety of maps, so you may want to include terms like UDOT or Utah in your search, along with the other keywords, since those should be included in the map description or tags. Once you've opened a map, you can explore it in the same ways that will be described in this video, except that some of the functionality is not available, like saving favorites or adding place marks. Returning to the login screen, if you have a Uplan account, use your Uplan credentials to sign in. The main menu provides access to the current map, any favorites you've saved, recent maps you've opened, maps that you're hosting in Uplan, and any groups that you are a part of. You can also search for maps or view the featured maps in Uplan. Something to note here is that the Explorer app cannot view apps or galleries in Uplan. If you want to view an app or gallery, you'll need to use a web browser. Once you've opened the map, you can interact with it in the typical way, pinch to zoom or double tap to zoom in, uh, drag the map to pan. Tap features to view the pop-up. If there are multiple features, you will need to choose the one you want. You can center on your current location by activating the GPS feature. You can view the legend for the map, or turn layers on or off, or choose to zoom to the features in the layer. The search option allows you to search for a location using a specific address or a more general place name like a city. From the menu, you can access bookmarks that have been saved in the map in Uplan. You can measure distances or areas by drawing on the map. You can change the units if you'd like. You can also sketch on the map, selecting the color of the line, line weight, and the opacity of the line. Note that it's based on your touch, it does not complete line segments like the measure tool. From the menu, you can also change the base map. You can add or remove the map from your favorites. It will then be included in your favorites folder in the, men in the main menu screen. Or you can share a screenshot of the map or send out a link. Lastly, with a long tap on the screen, you can choose to drop a pin at a location. This places a marker at that location that will be displayed in any map that you access in Explorer. Thank you for watching. Please contact Central GIS if you have any questions about Uplan or about accessing maps through the Explorer app.